Hello. Hello, all my wonderful crafty chuggers. How is everybody doing tonight? Welcome, welcome, welcome. My name is Becky Arnetta Carmes. I am an independent designer with Chalk Couture. Hello, Miss Emily. We're using a filter tonight because I look like a hot mess. So, this is filter tonight. So, tonight I'll let you guys kind of vote on what you guys wanted to create tonight. And you want to see what one only by like one vote. So it's pretty close. It's pretty close. But this is our winner. All you need is love is our winner for tonight. Yes, me and my little fairy filter. But before we start playing around with that one, we're going to play around with one of our brand new kits. Okay, we just had a brand new kit drop. Speaking of that, let me post it. I did already post. Um. I post on it already, but let me drop it here. Whoops, turn the volume down. Let's drop it. Did I already paste it? Probably not. So, let, wait a minute. Wait a minute, I'm in the wrong spot. Okay, I want that. Copy, and then we're going to come over here, and then we're going to drop it there. Okay, so we posted it. Let me find it, and let's put it to the top. Pin. Okay, so that new kit is pinned below as your first comment. So, it is our cute little P.S. I Love You kit. So, super, super cute. And with that link, you're going to go straight to the company website and you're going to get 20% off. So, with this kit, 20% off. Now, um, actually, I think the company does it. What surface do they do it on? Are they doing it on the board and base? Give me a sec. Yep, it's on the board and base. Okay. So it's the board and base, which is going to be this cute little board, and he can go vertical, he can go horizontal. Um, he's a chalkboard, so you can erase him and reuse it. It comes with two color chalk paste. Let's see if I can make that bigger. It's not gonna let me make it bigger. So the two paste colors is coral and shimmer silver. That's what comes in this kit, and it's twenty dollars and forty three cents. So that. Is the two colors that come in here. So you get the transfer, the board and base, the two color singles, one's a shimmer, and then you get a little squeegee. So that all comes in your kit and it's $20.43. So that's 20% off retail. So that is a wonderful deal. And we're going to start with that one first and then we're going to branch over and do the other project. So let's bring you down and I was kind of like going to use some different colors. Yeah. For some reason, I thought it was red. I thought it was red and white. So that's what I have here. That's what we're going to use. We're going to use red and white. So mine's going to look a little different than the one that comes in the kit. So here's our chalkboard. Like I said, it's two-sided. So look at this one. Your crazy is showing. You might want to tuck that back in. And look, you've got the little fairies in there. I know that's probably annoying. Okay, so we're going to tuck this transfer. Our transfers are adhesive back. They're reusable. I've already made one or two projects already with this little bad guy. So we're going to do what's called fuzzing first. That's just to loosen up that adhesive so it's not crazy sticky. And then we're going to put it on our chalkboard. But remember, you can put it on a wide range of surfaces. We're not bound to just a chalkboard. Put it on wood, glass, um, uh, picture frames, tin, furniture, microwave. Um, you could put this like on a filing cabinet. This would be cute because I mean, you know, it's kind of business related, right? So I'm thinking kind of business things. Maybe on um, some pl a plastic tub. Now plastic, you know, you're kind of, well, I'd still probably would still use chalk because it's plastic, um, but eventually it may scratch off. But here you go. Now a little tidbit for you. 
Eventually, you can erase the P.S. I love you, and you could put all kind of fun stuff up here because it's a typewriter, so you could kind of customize it and put somebody's name up here with our little fonts, or you can find other little sayings that you may like that's smaller and put them up there. So you've got that versatility up here on this piece of paper. Okay, so let's get busy. We're going to do our typewriter in white, and I think we're going to come back and do our P.S. I love you in the red. It's kind of like what I was envisioning tonight, because I obviously did not pay attention to the way the kit came and pull those colors out. And then I'm using a squeegee, because that's our paintbrush. If I have any new folks on here tonight, I've been doing um, a multiple vendor event. So hopefully I've got some of those folks over here hanging out with us tonight. So if I have any new folks on here that has never played with Chalk Couture before, give me a one in the comment. One in the comment if you've never played with Chalk before, and then give me a two if you have. Just so I know if I've got some newbies watching tonight. I'm just taking my white. And I'm just kind of doing the outline of this typewriter. If you've got the jars, you're going to go back over that, grab all that excess, and then put it back into your jar to reuse for later. Because, you know, we don't use a lot. A little goes a long ways. And then whatever color, and you could do it all in white if you wanted to. Or if you're going to add a little bit of an accent color, then grab your other color and then come back in here and do your little accent piece. Little goes a long way. Make sure it's covered. Okay, you ready? Peel and reveal time. Now remember, these transfers are reusable, so you're going to get 8 to 12 uses of them. 8 to 12 uses. And here we go. P.S. I love you with little fairy, whatever you want to call them, <laughs> the little stars that are coming on here. Because that's my filter tonight. Okay, so you're going to get the little base for him to sit in. And look at there. We made this project, guys, in probably five minutes. So as you can tell, it is super quick, fast, and easy. Okay? Easy, fast, super easy, quick. I know I've done that all in different orders that second time around. Ooh, is that thunder out there? Kind of a little bit of some shattering over there. So there you go. So this is our new little um, Trommy kit that just posted with Chalk Couture. You can get it for 20% off and then just look underneath the comments below. It's that first pinned comments is going to give you the link so you can grab this Trommy kit. $20 and some change. So pretty, pretty reasonable to try it out and a super cute project. Okay, so now we're going to move on to project number two. This is the one that everyone voted for to see tonight. All you need is love. As you can tell, I've already used this before. I've done this on a, um, I would say a Facebook party, but I think it's the event that I just finished. So it was, it was a multiple vendor event that I did a project with this on. And we're going to do it tonight on a, on a found surface. So this is not a Chalk Couture chalkboard. But we're going to use this cute little chalkboard here that hangs. But I want to show you what I did during that event. We done it on our Sylvie board. And it's the Sylvie board that's got the black frame and the white surface. So that's what it looks like on the Sylvie board. So I did it with the red flowers, the black wording, and then the green, of course, the greenery and green. So that's how I done it during that vendor event. So I love this Sylvie board because you've got that wide frame. Now the Sylvie board comes two ways. You can have the white background, the black frame, or you can have the black backboard and the white frame. So it comes both ways. And this is a Sylvie and it's a 9 by 12. So this is what I done during that vendor event I was telling you guys about. So I wanted to do this one a little different since I had that one right back there. So let's bring you down and we're going to do something different on this one just so you can see 
how it looks. Now, you know, sometimes when you use these transfers and some of the colors are gonna stain, see my, my transfer is stained, the reds, the oranges, the black, they're notorious on staining your transfer, but that's okay. It still works perfectly fine. It's just not as pretty as it was when you took it out of the package. We're gonna fuzz a couple of times. Now, normally for a chalkboard, I'll fuzz about two times. This is not a chalk couture chalkboard, so we're gonna fuzz it at least three times because anytime you're using a different type of chalkboard, you don't really know the quality of the chalkboard, so you want to play it safe because you don't want to stretch your transfer. Because remember, you're going to want to get your 8 to 12 uses out of this bad boy. I do anyway. I would imagine you do too. So I'm just positioning it because it's, it's, it's tight. It's just going to fit. <clears throat> it's just going to fit. I had to make sure it was going to fit. <clears throat> and I think tonight we're going to use um, a few colors. We're going to do some coloring. I think we're going to do some peony. We're going to do some berry. And I think we're going to bring in some yellow. I'm just feeling colorful tonight. I'm kind of kicking into to spring. <laughs> it's January and I'm kicking into spring, guys. Kicking into spring. So let me check my consistencies of my paste so because I've got some of these that are older paste. So let me make sure it's the right consistency. All of your paste now is our creamy dreamy formula. So you don't really have to worry about the consistency, but I've got some old jars here when we had the older formula. So it is chalk paste. So it's chalk. Chalk is water-based, it's non-toxic. And the longer you leave the lids off of it, the more apt it is to dry out. So, you know, if you're not one to chalk a lot and you've got a jar and it kind of sits for a while and you noticed it's getting thicker, then just add a little distilled water in here and stir it up. You wanted the consistency of like Greek yogurt, sour cream consistency. So, you know, we're not too far off, but we could add just a little bit more distilled water in there. Stir it up some more. I think this is our this is our new formula. So see, you got that creamy, dreamy texture, and then I think this one's an older formula. So see, it's kind of a chunky monkey. How do y'all like me coming up with these little names? Creamy, dreamy, chunky monkey. I think that is latte in there whining. Oh, she's whining because it's thundering. It's thundering, guys. Luckily, Eddie still has her thunder jacket on. For too long, they're probably going to be underneath me here. So I'm just adding some distilled water in here, stirring it up. So you kind of want to check your paste consistency. Like I said, you guys, unless I've got some, some older folks on here that's got the older textures, if you've got the older paste, then you want to make sure your paste are gonna, is going to be the right consistency before you start. So that's the new. You see how it's creamy there? Creamy, dreamy. Because once you start, you're going to want to either rock and roll or either you're going to do the peel, um, the chalk and peel technique. So let's put you over here and let's start since green's down there. We'll just start with our green. So this is eucalyptus. It's like a blue green. It's almost like a sea foam green. That's what I'm using for the greenery part. And you could do this all in one color. You could. And you know, white is gorgeous. I think black and white is timeless. But you know, if you're wanting to add some color, we're going to add some color tonight. Ooh, some thunder. Can y'all hear that? Anybody, can y'all hear my thunder? <clears throat> I think we're just gonna do we're just gonna do halfway. So everybody have a good day. Anybody do anything 
fun and exciting today. So I'm just going to do the chalk and peel. Since this is the old formula I'm using, I'm just releasing it out of my transfer. And I'm just going to drop it down ever so lightly. I'm going to figure out what color I'm going to do next. I think I'm going to do these flowers in yellow. And I think I'm going to do these bottom ones. Maybe in that berry color. Let's make sure I've got enough squeegees here. And a disinfectant wipe would be... My dogs despise thunder. I can't stand it. Okay, I had to clean an extra squeegee here. So this is, I think this one's berry. Yep, this one's berry. I'm gonna do berry down here on the bottom. going to do yellow. Still don't have enough squeegees, do I? I don't. So this one's called Bumblebee. got those two colors. Probably going to have to clean me another squeegee here in a minute. Don't want to move on and do some white. We can because all that is new colors, which means it's creamy dreamy and you can do more chalking and it doesn't dry as fast as the older stuff, which will give me some time to work on some words. It's going to be so springy. It's going to be a cross between um, Valentine's Day and spring. This could carry over into spring as well. It's one of those decor pieces that you can bring out for Valentine's Day and then you can just keep it out through the spring. Looks like I have a bubble there. Awesome. Hopefully that didn't mess up. We'll find out here in just a minute. One nice thing about a chalkboard is if you don't like the way it turns out, you can always erase it and redo it. That's what I love about Talk Couture. It's what I love, what I love, what I love. Yep. Yeah. You see how I had my bubble? See how the U had the bubble in there? So I had an air pocket. So I had um, paste all over the place. Okay, let's get that out. Get all my greenery pieces down and my peony down. Let's clean me a squeegee. It's two here. You mean it's, what, it's 2 o'clock, and it's not 2 o'clock in the morning, right, or 2 o'clock in the afternoon, is it, are you telling me the temperature is 2? Oh, oh, oh my goodness. No, thank you. No, thank you. It's probably what you're meaning, Patty, isn't it, is you're telling me your temperature is 2? Too cold for my blood. green back to the eucalyptus I 
I'll have to figure out what I'm going to have you guys vote on for Wednesday. I had fun with that. Did y'all have fun kind of giving me a little tidbit of what you guys wanted to, to see tonight? Was that fun for you guys? So, this is the way it looks. All you need is love. Let's bring you up so you can actually see it with my little pixie stars. Okay, so what we're going to do is this is a chalkboard, right? It's a chalkboard. Don't let chalkboards scare you. Don't let this craft scare you. <clears throat> this is an easy, easy, easy craft, guys. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually, I'm just going to take a disinfectant wipe here. I'm going to be careful and I'm just going to see if I can just get this part off. Trying not to run into the other pieces. Now, if this had been a piece of wood, you know, I might would have been in trouble. A wood piece of wood is as um, porous. So, A, that's why when you're using wood, you're going to want to put some wax on it. Because if you put a layer of wax on it, you can try. Sometimes, sometimes you can get it up. You can't always, but you can sometimes. So, if you were to have a piece of wood and you this happened to the wood, then you, if as long as you waxed it, you can try to do like we just did here. If it doesn't work, you could take a piece of sandpaper, wait for it to dry, and then take a piece of sandpaper and try to see if you can sand it off and see if you can do that. You know, worst case, you can paint your board. Or you can just flip the board over and do it again on the back side. Okay, so what we're going to do now is I got to clean my transfer. So we're going to clean our transfer kind of a cheating way. Certainly, I can send some crafts to you. Have you found some crafts that you like? Um, are you in my VIP page? Let's see, how do we say your name? Karika? Karika, you are in the U.S., right, Karika? I'm probably torturing your name. I do apologize. As long as you're in the United States, I can send stuff to you. You are not in the United States. Um, the only place that we can do it other than the U.S. is Canada. So, so no, you're not in my VIP page. You're in the United States. Good. Okay. Um, once I'm done, I'll send you a link to my VIP page. In my VIP page, I have I have um, quite a few kits I've put together already for my VIP members, especially stuff that's like Valentine's Day related. And you can see if I've got any kits already put aside that you'd like, and I can send you a kit. You're not liking Valentine's Day? Okay, so I'll send you the link to my VIP page. And then, um, have you looked at my online store? It's chalkcouture.com slash crafts by Becky and the number two. Oh, you do want Valentine's crafts. Okay. I do have quite a few Valentine's kits inside that VIP page. So, we'll start there. We'll start in the VIP page. You take a look, see, see if you like anything I've got in there. And we'll kind of go from there. I will do that once I'm done and get you some goodies in the mail. Of course, we've got that one we started off with tonight that's on our Chalk Tour page. And I've got lots of kits over in my VIP page. I'm sorry, Eddie. Where are you at, Eddie? Eddie, where are you at? Hey babe, you okay? So I'm just taking a disinfectant wipe here and I'm kind of getting that chalk out of the U. Normally I do this in the sink in the bathroom. 
that. We're not in the sink in the bathroom, are we? I'm here with you in the craft room. Okay, so what we're gonna do now is I'm gonna put it in the inside of my fuzzy cloth is a disinf is um it's a microfiber cloth, so it's like a drying cloth. So I'm gonna see if I can dry that U. And I just wanna dry that U because I still got chalk on everything else. And I just washed this fuzzing cloth. Hey babe, you okay? You okay? You okay? She is petrified of thunder. Get underneath my footsies. Get underneath my footsies. Okay, I think that's good. So I've cleaned the transfer. I've cleaned it right there where the U is. I clean the U. So let's see if we can kind of line this up. I made sure that I got it dry. And let's figure out where it needs to go. And I'm just gonna press down just the U. I'm gonna get my white. And here we go again, round two for the U. This is why I love chalkboards. I love dry erase boards. I love to be able to erase and then reuse. You guys know I've got the um, the big 14, no, 14. I've got the big 18 by 18 Sylvie frame in my foyer. And you know, when the season's over, I always change it out with you guys and then I go put it back in the foyer. So that makes um, decorating so easy, so easy. Look, we fixed it. I'm gonna have to come back over there and fix it. You can see where I kind of got rid of the U around it, but look, we fixed it. Awesome blossom. Okay, guys, so here we go. All you need is love. We done that with youth eucalyptus was our green. The letters were in white. Peony for that top flower, um, bumblebee for the yellow flower, and then I used berry at the bottom, which is like a purple, a purpley pink. But you really could have used um, peony the whole the whole time, because you can't really tell the difference, can you? Okay, so this was our second project, and then we done this as our first project. The I P S I love you on the board and base. Super easy. We done two projects in 30 minutes. And we need to come up with a sprinkle word, don't we? Let me get the dog. Come here. Come here. Because you know we do uh, sprinkling. If you are gracious enough to do some sprinkling for me, sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. Um, sprinkle this to your family, to your wall. Share the talk love for me. Um, you can enter my weekly game. So you can sprinkle every day. Sprinkle today and tomorrow and the next day. Sprinkle every day all the way to Wednesday. Wednesday at 6 o'clock p.m. Central Time, my game ends. You can go catch Wednesday night's um, replay. Watch it. Grab the sprinkle word and you can sprinkle that one too. So you can sprinkle both of them every day up till Wednesday. Wednesday at 6 o'clock, my contest is over. And then um, I'll come live at 7.45 p.m. Wednesday night and we'll draw a winner for the week. So winner for the week and then we'll make something fun. Fun, fun, fun. So what do I mean when I say sprinkle for any new folks? This is another word for sprinkling. You know, we can't say that other word on here. Ouch, this dog is scratching me. So this is Itty. So Itty, you wanna say hey to everybody? Okay, you, let's see if you can, it gets you pretty. Does it make you pretty? Look at the camera. Say, I am Itty and I'm petrified. Petrified of thunder. Oh my goodness, I'm so scared. And tell everybody, hey. Say, hey everybody. Okay guys, you have a wonderful night. And I will catch you guys later. Y'all take care.